guys today we're at franklin's barbecue here in austin texas many consider to be one of the best barbecue spots in the whole world and i have to say there's a huge line of people waiting for their food and me being me you know i had to try the barbecue so i got five pounds of barbecue for a total price of 169 dollars and 13 cents so let's see how it tastes and starting off we got the brisket over here i mean take a look at this look at how juicy and moist it is the water is flowing on the sides of the brisket has a perfectly good bark and the smoke ring is absolutely beautiful i mean just look at it look at how tender it is oh man got a nice little bite cheers guys Damn. oh hands down this is the best brisket i've ever had the best brisket just the ratio of fatty areas to lean meat and a good meaty sensation that's soft tender and juicy Mmm. And the seasoning too, they kept it very simple. Just some salt, some pepper, and some other things. But they let the brisket, the meat shine in all its glory. Plus, when eating, you get a nice smoky feel that's not overpowering, but just right, which adds to the flavor. Next though, we got the pork ribs. I mean, take a look at this. Look at this massive piece of pork rib seasoned to perfection. That crust of load is absolutely majestic. Got a nice little pinkish color to it too. Ooh. Cheers, guys. Oof, and I tell you, one bite, your body gets shot up with dopamine full of ecstasy because this thing has flavor. It's not for the bone, but has a good bite, very meaty, thick pieces of meat, the soft, tender, and juicy, has a good smoky feel, and the seasoning is on point. It's very peppery, but mixed with salt and whatever else they use, absolutely delicious. And next up, I got the jalapeno cheese sausage. Oh my lord, I didn't think two pounds was going to be this much. And this one looks like absolutely delicious. Cheers, guys. Mmm, -hmm. sausage itself is just okay, you know, not that flavorful. It is juicy, it's tender, has a good snap, but the jalapeno and cheddar, you don't really taste it at all. Especially the jalapeno, it's not even there, and the cheese itself is just very minuscule. Not that great. And we also got a regular sausage over here. Cheers, guys. Also not that great, it doesn't really have much flavor either. It is juicy, it's tender, has a good snap, but it's just not flavorful. And we also got some potato salad. Let's get a good little bite, good little spoonful. Cheers, guys. Oh, this has a strong mustard flavor. It's pretty good, you know. It's creamy. Potatoes are soft and tender. Good amount of seasoning. This is pretty good. Next, though, we got the pinto beans. Oh, my Lord. There is so much liquid. Honestly, this is the wettest beans I have ever seen. Oh, man. Let's get a good little spoonful of some meat and some beans. Nice little bite. Cheers, guys. And I don't really like this. Beans themselves are tender, but not much flavor. And the meat inside is so dry and tough. Not a great experience. Plus, it feels like I'm drinking a bean soup. Honestly, after trying out the foods, I have to say it's a mixed feeling. Like those brisket and ribs, absolutely top tier. I'll be coming back time and time again for them. But the sausages and sides, they were just okay. Nothing too special. Overall, I rate a good Franklin's Barbecue, solid 8.9. Those brisket and ribs are heavenly. 